हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम यू ऑल ऑन यूर पीडिया एजुकेशन सो माय डियर स्टूडेंट एज यू नो एग्जामिनर ऑफ पेटेंट एंड डिजाइन रिक्रूटिंग ऑलमोस्ट 220 वैकेंसीज एंड इफ वी टॉक अबाउट द कंप्यूटर साइंस सो 55 वैकेंसीज आर देयर सो व्हाट इज द सिलेबस एंड व्हाट इज द स्ट्रेटजी एंड व्हाट टाइप ऑफ प्रॉब्लम्स यू मे फेस इन दिस एग्जाम सो माय डियर स्टूडेंट्स इफ वी टॉक अबाउट द टेक्निकल सब्जेक्ट्स दिस टाइम टेक्निकल सब्जेक्ट्स आर आस्क इन द मेन एग्जाम फाइन and that is descriptive in nature not the mcq type that is descriptive in nature so if we talk about the syllabus so see in computer science department so for computer science vacancies the first topic is digital logic fine so almost the syllabus is related to gate only and in the digital again we have to the syllabus is or the topic is minimization number system then floating point number system combinational circuit and sequential circuit so if we talk about coa that is computer organization and architecture again the syllabus is same it is related to gate only like we have to uh, know about the addressing modes like memory input output wise control type control unit fine so if we talk about the programming and data structure again we have to go with the basics of c then linked list tree graph stack queue all this stuff and if we talk about the algorithm the next subject is algorithm so in algorithm again we have to discuss about the divide and conquer technique time complexity greedy technique dynamic technique and com computational theory that is p and p and p hard and and p complete so the next subject is toc that is theory of computation again we have to go with the finite automata push down automata then context sensitive language then re r e c and undecidability part in the same manner if we talk about the compiler all the phases are covered in this syllabus so if we talk about the operating system next subject is operating system that is again the same as git syllabus how we have to find we have to know the processes synchronization deadlock part memory io file system and securities again in dbms that is database management system same indexing basics normalization then sql queries from and then transactions and all this stuff and security also then go with the next part is information system and software engineering again we have to know about the different type of life cycles how to manage the project how to plan the project how to design test implementation and maintenance part and next is the computer network so in again computer network we have to follow with the again osi stack so we have application layer then data link layer network layer transport layer and application layer fine then the last subject is web tech in web tech we have basics of web tech that is html xml then basic concept of client server computing so that is all about the syllabus so if we talk about the main subject that is computer network algorithm database management system toc compiler operating system then so or digital so these are the main subjects which ask in the this exam fine but the point is the paper is descriptive in nature so student has a, a doubt like what type of questions are asked in this paper fine till now as if you already prepare for the gate or any other uh, higher exam or this level of exam so you are a bit comfortable with the mcq part fine but now this paper is descriptive in nature so you have to write the whole step by step procedure and then give you your solutions so what type of questions is asked or will be asked in this exam so i have a uh, one previous paper so i want to discuss that paper with you fine c that is very important because once you go through this paper you can download this paper from the website your www.urpedia.in from there you can download this paper fine <laughs> and it's a great vacancy like it's a very good vacancy it's a group a vacancies okay fine okay c this is the paper of year gate 2018 fine and see how what type of question they will ask you c describe the worst case running time of the following pseudo code in bigo notation so you have to tell that why it is order of n order of log n order of n square order of n log n whatever will be the answer you have to 
justify your answer that yes uh, um, this this one has the first instruction so it will execute or or it will take that much amount of time second instruction take that much amount of time that is overall is this much amount of time move on the second question suppose a web server has 10 ongoing tcp connections so it is based on the computer network so you have to find out how many server side sockets are used so you have to give the total detail because we have 10 ongoing TCP connections. So how many sockets we are used and how many server side port number are used. Fine. So if we have any formula, if we have any theory behind that, you have to mention that theory. See the next problem. Like it's an op operating system problem. Next. What is the size of TCP header? So you have to tell the size of TCP header. You have to make a diagram find TCP header diagram. So what is the size of UDP header? So you have to tell about the what is the size of UDP header? What is the format of UDP? And then which field exists in both TCP header and UDP header? The point is you have to give the theory. You have to give your answer in the theory part. Fine. Next problem is describe one advantage and disadvantage of circuit switching network over a packet switching we know what is circuit switching we know what is packet switching so fine you have to give like when we can use the server that is circuit switch network and when we have to use the packet switch network what are the differences what are the advantages so in one in it will take less time in one it will take more time one has dedicated path other doesn't have dedicated path so you have to give this detail now moving towards the next part that is it's a very simple problem draw the binary mean heap we have these elements and we have to draw the mean heap so you have to give step by step procedure how to create a mean heap next describe the mechanism of priority inheritance fine next find the language generated by following grammar you know what is this grammar and what type of language it is generated by this grammar you have to give the detailed description like this is production number one two three four and five so if we have production number one what type of strings we can generate from this production number one so in this way you have to give the detailed answer next again cn go back and arq we have some bandwidth we have some delay so we have to find out the maximum data rate possible we have to find out the maximum data rate possible again it's a simple question but the point is you have to give the answer in a detailed manner next again computer network problem next again you can uh, say that it is a digital question so we have to find out the minimum number of states or you can go with the toc also and next in section c we have like one schedule is given and we have to find out is it conflict equivalent serial schedule or not if yes then which serial schedule it is then we have to draw the binary search tree so the point is there is no difference between the gate preparations and in this paper but the point is if you know the concept if you know the step by step procedure then you have to write the whole steps in this paper fine so my dear students <coughs> it's a great opportunity for you yes construct a minimal dfa where all the binary numbers where each binary number is divisible by three very simple problem next again we have to solve this recurrence relation using the master theorem we know we have to find out n k power log a base b we have to find out f of n and whatever the case we can apply you have to mention that part in the next part we have it's um, like linear programming questions and then next again greedy programming questions and in the same manner it is a again up like one problem which is like context free language or not we have to identify fine so the point is in this paper you have to write your solutions in a detailed manner because this is descriptive in nature so my dear students if you are a bit comfortable with like the steps or the procedure then it is easy for you and the point is it's a great vacancy it's a group a gazetted vacancy is fine so my dear students you can download this paper from yourpedia.in website and from like thursday onwards we are going to start our dedicated batch fine for the first part primly part and for the mains part fine so right now we are just main focusing on the primary part but yes parallelly we already started like we start our classes for the main exam also fine 
so your pdf provide you the dedicated batch so if you want to like um, get your dream job then you you can join this module and if you have any query then go to yourpedia.in and ask your doubt there okay so your pedia team will reach out to you so if you have any query please write on the comment section box and you can download this paper from www.yourpedia.in thank you so much